I didn't have an initial vision for this Craigslist antique armoire, mainly because its many charms were hidden until I started removing the original finish and carefully sanding all the surfaces. My efforts to get the entire piece down to the original wood were worth it once I saw the richness of the book-matched veneers of the cabinet doors and the flame mahogany drawers. While I was able to do much of this work with a power sander, I had to carefully hand sand the distinct veneer pieces of the doors. I decided then that a multi-step paste wax finish would best bring out the deep colors and patterns of these important features. Other key steps included painting the inside of the cabinet black to mask the beat up surfaces and staining the narrow face frame a deep ebony color to bring even greater definition to the doors and drawers. After applying multiple coats of paste wax to the main cabinet and drawers, I turned my attention to the doors, where I decided to highlight the arch effect of the veneer pattern by staining the border a contrast color. I was pleased with how this came out. Next, it was time to sand down and stain the original wooden handles to match the face frame, and then reinstall them. Finally, I touched up some problem areas where neither wax nor stain would take. Fine tip sharpies seemed to work best. As my expert woodworker brother Paul shared, if it solves the problem, go for it. The beauty of the final product surprised me relative to what it looked like when I bought it, and was immediately put into use as a much needed china and linen cabinet. Follow or subscribe at Design Marquee. Thanks for watching.